farther away from Tommy. He might have hit that a long way. Yes, he's gone. Wilson pitches out of it. Strike right there in the outside corner. Has a 5-3 lead. Pitch, yes. He paints him on the inside corner. Curveball grounded towards shortstop. Ozzie over to second for one. Can Graybeck turn it? Yes, they do. Big 6-4-3 double play. Sox get out of it. After six, they still lead it by two. Gossage on to the seventh. Joey Cora. Juice ball. Only his third home run in 1,383 at bats. The chef looks for some of the juice. Gossage pours some. And Frank Thomas, 428 feet. The big hurts 11. Some one twins up one zip. Nope, not anymore. Frank Thomas takes Polito out. His 16th. Speaking of collector's items, go get it. Then the bottom of the fifth, the Sox are up 2 1. No, not anymore. That's Frank's 17th of the year. Part of a four for five game, five RBIs. White Sox just enjoyed the rest of it. Little Norberto Martin, suicide squeeze. The Zupper scores. Loosen up, man. Bases loaded two out, but Julio Franco, what a season he's having. Flares one into right. Ozzie Guillen back in the lineup, scores. So does Tim Raines. 3 0 Sox. McDonald didn't get out of the third. Bottom five, still 3 0. Frank Thomas against Tom Bolton. What a month Frank Thomas is having. And it continues. Another shot to right center field is 19th of the year. Homers in four consecutive games. Got him on the outside corner. And it's out number one. He got him on a good splitter, so Junior's gone. 2 0 last year against the Mariners. 2 2 5 earned run average. He shut him out last year on a Sunday night. He punches him out. He got him on a splitter. Another one, two, three inning for Black Jack tonight, but Jack McDowell has done him two better so far as Griffey goes down on strike. He got him. High in the left field. Tim Raines has the B. He's there. Yes. Black Jack McDowell outduels Randy Johnson. Fernandez. Had it going on. Jose Valentin, sit down swinging. Jody Reed, sit down looking. And Turner Ward, just plain sit down. 10 Ks for Fernandez. Sox win it. Meanwhile, at virtually the same time on the south side, 0 for 19 slump for Norberto Martin. And he breaks that by smacking one over Matt Mieske's head in the bottom of the ninth with two out. Here comes Karkovice. White Sox win 3 to 2. Alfield swung around to the left. Pretty good lead by Paco. Is that ball hit in the center field? Gibson backing up. Warren Newsom tagging. Here he comes. He will score. And the game is tied at two. Yeah. Already setting up down the middle. That ball hit high and deep in the right up. field. Get up. Junior Felix back. And cannot no. make the play. Here comes Martine. Here comes Lance Johnson. And the Sox lead it four to two. Yeah. Yes. That ball Hello. hit hard in the left field. Way back. You can put it on the board. Yes. A two-run shot by the Big Hurt. And it's 6-2 Sox. One for eight in this series. That ball hit hard in the left center field. Ricardo Ingram goes back. It'll be off the base of the fence. So a leadoff double for Ventura. That ball way back. You can put it on the board. Yes. I mean, a rocket out of here for Ventura. His 14th homer, 59th RBI, and it's 5 1 Sox. Play there. Top of the eighth now, 4 3 Sox, and Fernandez paints the corner, getting Albert Bell, and then in the eighth, it's Ron Karkovice taking Eric Plunk deep on a 3 2 fastball for a home run. His 11th. That ball hit deep into center field. Well back at the fence, looks up, you can put it on the board! Yeah. 34th home run of the year, tied it at 9. 13th inning now, bottom of the 13th. Julio Franco, Cecil Fielder, gets it to 2nd, but Travis Fryman's relay is over Storm Davis's head. Joey Cora scores ga the game winner. Squares the butt. There it is, Murray bubbles the ball, everybody is going to be safe. He throws it away! Here comes Franco! They're going to hold Ventura third on a mistake by Eddie Murray. 
three, and the game is tied at five. Yes! One time. The 2-2. Two -two. That's into left field. Albert Bell backing up. Ventura tagging. Bell makes the catch. Here comes Robin. Here comes the throw. Not in time. Sox lead at six to five. Yes! Yes! yes. Gas. He's gone. Fastball into left field. This is a can of corn for Tim Raines as he is there. Yes! And the Sox come back after trailing five to four with two runs in the top of the eighth inning. They take the first of this huge, huge four game set. The ball hit deep in the right field. Way back, Ramirez looks up. You can put it on the board. Yes! Line drive, solo homer by Franco, and the Sox lead it four to two. There's a shot up the middle base end. Here comes one dog. Oh, the throw behind. The runner in the second base. Lance Johnson scores, and the Sox lead it five to four. He's dangerous. He's swinging the bat well. That ball hit hard. Lance Johnson right there. Yes! Oh, he hit a bullet. Nice going, Gene Lamont. And Frank Thomas teaches Lorraine's pitch. Goodbye. A skyrocket. Number 38 on the year. RBIs 98 and 99, 4 0. Roberto Hernandez facing Bo Jackson. And he taps one to Robin Ventura, who throws it away. And the Angels live. Harold Reynolds pinch runs for Jackson. Greg Myers at the plate. Single. 10-10 ball game into the 10th inning. In the top half of the frame, it is Joey Cora delivering Jackson, who would let off the frame with a double. 11 to 10. Fingernail. Left the game. Top nine, five, three Angels, one out. Russ Springer, Mike Lavalier has not homered since August 22nd, 1992. It's out of here. 5-5 five, five, Lavalier with his first homer of nearly two years. Top of the 12th, nobody out. Guillen at third. And off Joe McGrain, Joey Cora with the blooper just over Harold Reynolds. That opens up the floodgates. Missing the strike, the ball dies between Terry Steinbach's legs, and that's going to allow Julio Franco to score, make breaking the 1-1 tie. That's Ricky Henderson fighting the sun, and what a fight he did, catching one, stealing one from Frank Thomas. 2-1 to one White Sox. Two outs for the A's with Ricky at third. Troy Neal at the plate for Oakland, and Hernandez strikes him out. Two to one, White Sox. In first place at, the, at this at this junction, so you know there's. Uh, hope everyone's optimistic about us coming back because we're we're gonna come back sooner or later. Well, it is now official. No more regular season. No extended version of the playoffs. And for the first time since 1904, no World Series. Like a lot of things in life, you um, anticipate something and fear that it's coming. Hope that it isn't. And when the day uh, is here, uh, there's an incredible amount of sadness.